Hey guys, Kid Justice here, and today I'm going to show you how you can make naturally spawning ore in vanilla Minecraft. So the first thing you're going to want to do is give yourself a command block using this command right here. See, now we have our command block, so we're going to have to add two new score object scoreboard objectives. So let's say, just do scoreboard objectives, add, what, what ore should we make? Sugar ore, then add that as a dummy objective. Now, what you're going to want to do as well is um, game rule command block output false. Now, get rid of all the messages. Next, you want to do scoreboard objectives add s o s spawn. You can name the scoreboards whatever you want. I just do it like this because it makes me feel more organized. And click that to always active. Now you have two scoreboard objectives. Next, I'm going to show you how you actually make the ore itself. The next thing you want to do is place down a repeating command block and set it to always active. And um, you want to do scoreboard players set all entities. Um, we're going to be using armor stands. Armor stand with the name of sugar, sugar ore. And you can name it whatever you want. I just do it because organization, and you want to add the scoreboard objective I'm sorry it's add you need to add it's sugar or one then we need another chain uh, unconditional always active and then and then here's where we're going to need to jump into a website so now we want to make ourselves a custom block for it. So go to this um go to this site here and you're going to need to download the resource pack which you can click on that. I already have the resource pack installed. And then and then what you're going to do is you're going to click on the texture you want for the first texture. I'm going to pick this and then change the color of it. I'm going to make it look kind of like stone. You're not going to get this perfect, but it's okay. And you can make it glow if you want to or not. Then you can choose uh, a layer 3 or and a layer 2. I'm just going to pick a layer 2. Same premise, just pick a color and then adjust. You can adjust the color from here. I'm going to keep it white because we're doing sugar and then yeah and then once you're done with that generate the command and all we need is is um, inside the quotations where it says command so only this part of the command is what we need so control C and copy that go back into Minecraft and then type in and then type in execute All entity score sug sugar or minimum equals one and then score sugar or equals two. This will give it enough time for it to properly um properly summon. Then 
just put those three squiggly things and then paste that in. So now it should look like this. And then you need to put down another chain command block. And then and then um execute all in the score sugar or minimum equals three detect error zero and then now we'll come over head over to MC stacker and get a command and make a command so head over to this website and then go down there there it's a generator for commands so click on item I can find it click on item and then you don't need a name for it now just type in sugar you don't want sugar cane and count one you can also add a custom tag to it it doesn't really matter it'll still work so it works with um, custom items made from resource packs and then set the Y to zero and then if you want to you can play with the motion to make it jump out like most ores but this is just simple tutorial so we're gonna just do this so copy this and paste it right there and then and then uh, that command is done and then we need another chain command block actually just copy this one control button 3 and then delete the command we just got put in and then and then kill all entities score sugar or and minimum equals three radius equals one so what we did by copying it is we copied this whole string and saved less and saved um, some of the workload. And make sure this is directly after this one, otherwise it won't work. So then we put down another chain chain command block. And then we do scoreboard players add all e type equals whatever mob you want to be the trigger for it this is for um, it naturally spawning into the world so I'm just gonna put zombie and then SOS spawn 1 and make sure that's always active and then execute all entities score SOS minimum equals one comma score SOS no not SOS SOS sp spawn equals two and then detect detect Um, you can do any block you want You can do any block you want if you will do a type of carpet or snow what layer just um, get rid of the minus one if you want to spawn above you can do um, Just two but Yeah stone zero and then Go back into MC edit then We go still on the summon tab. We go to armor stand we put no gravity, small, and invisible, and marker on. 
and then and then we put the name click hide name put the name as sugar or or like that and then we put this to minus one and then with that running we should be able to go into game mode spectator we should be able to find some, find some ore put some of this ore some mob spawner over here so if we look around lot if we look around like as you can see there's now the sugar ore here spawning naturally whenever a zombie spawns and this is how I'm going to do it in one of my new command projects I'm working on so, and as you can see there are the armor stands but yeah so if we go into back into creative and um, kill a few friends here it seems like there's a bug in our command that's causing this so if we go fix that we can um, if we go find out what's wrong, we can uh, fix how it works. So, gotta go find your command, and then, and then we go game mode C, and then if it's it keeps spawning, it's in this command right here. So, so for um this command, it's. It's adding all of them, and it's uh, doing that. So if we really want to debug, um, we need to get some stone and a zombie spawn egg, and put down the stone, and it seems to be working fine. But that's happening. So, so if we do, as you can see, it's um, setting the score. It's adding the score. But over here, somehow, it's there's a period right there. That's why. So, make sure that's a comma. And yeah, that. There's some simple debugging for you if that doesn't work. So now, so now, if we put now for more debugging purposes to make sure that that was the problem, just put down the zombie egg again, punch him around the stone, and if it doesn't spawn more, then it's good. So we go back into spectator. And we should just find some of that war that we just created. Like, not down there. These are a bunch of zombies from earlier, so. If we. Go over and find somewhere, like right here. This is a newly spawned zombie. It spawned its the ore. So if we go to survival, probably would help if we had a pickaxe. So we'll give we'll give ourselves a pickaxe real quick, and when we mine it, it'll leave down a piece of sugar. And, um, I'll put all, all these commands I'll put in the description so that you can copy and paste them in your command box and then you can 
please know. Um, and then you can put them in your command box and modify them a little bit so that you could so that it's easier for you to make these. And that was my video for today and see you guys all later.